In this video, we will learn how to write Python loops. These are very useful for repeated sets of commands. Open Creative Suite, and write the opening turtle definition. We'll also write the tina.hide and tina.show commands. Let's start with an equilateral triangle. We go 30 units, then turn 120 degrees. We do this again to make the other two sides. But there's a better way to do this. It is easy to make mistakes when writing or editing so many lines. We might change one line, but forget to change another. Instead of typing lines over and over again, we can write a Python repeat loop. We start a loop by typing 4. We will work with i later, but ignore it for now. The range is 3, which means that the body of the loop will be repeated 3 times. Don't forget the colon at the end of the line. Each command line to be repeated is indented 2 spaces. This set of commands is called the body of the loop. Let's run the program again. And we can see that it draws the same triangle. Now let's play with numbers in the loop to create different polygons. Let's draw a square. Change the range to 4 and the angle measurement to 90. That's it! Now we have a square. Let's try a pentagon. The angle of turn for a regular polygon will always be 360 degrees divided by the number of sides, or edges. 360 divided by 5 equals 72 degrees. Let's try a hexagon. For a hexagon, the range will be 6 and the turn will be 60 degrees. And there's our hexagon. Let's try a circle. A circle can be thought of as a regular polygon with a lot of sides. Change the range to 60, shorten the side length to 1, and change the angle to 6. There's our circle. It's a little small, but that is easy to fix. Change the step size from 1 to 3. Think of all the lines of code you would have had to change if you didn't use a loop. If you want, you can change the color and width before you start the loop, and extrude the shapes for printing. The extrude command is not part of the loop, so it will not be indented. An extruded circle is a ring that can be printed. Experiment with some different ranges, steps, and angles. Remember that the first line is written 4i in range. The body of the loop is indented. For loops are a great way to write repeated commands. They are easy to write and edit. Have fun, and don't forget to save your creations. We will learn more about complex loops later on.